Brown. Freaking rats. <laughs> I think she gave up. <laughs> Show us your moves, Yannick. Oh, get it. Oh, get it. Now here comes my favorite part of the day. Squeezing into an elevator with 15 other students like I'm a sexy sardine trying to get her education. <laughs> hey fairies, it's Kenzie Fay. I post videos about fashion, faith, and my experiences abroad. And just as those quick clips showed you a glimpse into my day, I want to give a quick exposition about my life abroad. In the fall semester of 2023, I studied abroad at a Chinese university called United International College, and it fulfilled my lifelong dream of living in China, if only for half a year. During my time there, I experienced some life-changing connections, and I owe it all to the people I met at UIC. But enough about that. Time to let you see what you came here for. This video is sponsored by Glitzy Nails, but more on that later. Good morning, fairies! It is currently 7 a.m. and I have an 8 a.m. early civilizations class to get my booty to this morning. Right now, we're on the phase two campus, which currently is just dorm buildings. All of my classes are on phase one. I live with three roommates, one which I share a bedroom with, and my routine every Tuesday morning means sneaking out of bed without waking them up and going to our common room to put on my face. Today's activities include attending three classes, eating and studying with some friends, picking up packages from the campus Cainyao, then going to eat barbecue with my buddies. And I'm taking you guys along with me. My Mandarin has improved tons since coming to China, at least my pronunciation. My grammar is honestly still kindergarten level. Bye bye, kids. Bye bye. But thankfully, that just means that my Chinese friends find me endearing in a dumb foreigner kind of way. I'm definitely gonna be late for my first class, my 8 a.m. today. It's because I woke up and I was like, screw this, I'm just gonna be late. There's my bus! Oh, not that one. I meant this one. And now we are embarking on a five minute journey to Campus One. Usually I try to walk since there's a cool ancient village between the phases and it only takes 20 minutes to walk, but there ain't no way I'm waking up 20 minutes earlier for an 8 a.m. class. Knowing me, I was out late last night and only got six-ish hours of sleep. Now, mind you, it is November 28th at the time of this day in the life. But look at this weather, gorgeous, warm, lovely. Gotta love Southern China in the fall slash winter. Also, take a quick peek at the fits. Looking drippy in China is so easy because all the stores sell cute and affordable clothing. Hear that? Cute and affordable. Now here comes my favorite part of the day. Squeezing into an elevator with 15 other students like I'm a sexy sardine trying to get her education. Oh. I'm just barely on time. One minute. This class that I'm about to attend is actually one of my favorites of the five that I'm taking this semester. This professor is a hard grader, but he's so smart and the subject matter can be so interesting. It's about like ancient China, ancient Greece, ancient civilizations in general, and you learn some really fun facts. And I even have some cool classmate buddies that I get along really well with. I just do it all. Today, one of said buddies gave me some dried jerky meat after I said I was hungry. What a sweetheart. The jerky managed to hold me over, but the moment that we had our five minute break, I ran down five flights of stairs to buy vanilla yogurt pudding and some moist pumpkin bread. Now that class is over, I am heading back to my dorm to change my clothes because I hate my fit right now. Then I will grab my materials for my next two classes. It takes about five minutes of speed walking to get to the buses from the teaching buildings, so I made it barely in time for the 10 a.m. shuttle bus. Barely on time is kind of the name of the game for me. I'm honestly a professional. 
Hey fairies, I'm cutting in right here to introduce today's sponsor, Glitzy Nails. Glitzy is a hand-painted, custom-sized, press-on nail service. I have been wearing Glitzy nail sets since 2022, and it has completely replaced my desire to go to nail salons here in the U.S. Unlike getting your nails done at a regular nail salon, Glitzy Nails are affordable and reusable. Choose from tens of designs or order your own custom set, then your nail artist, who, plot twist, is me, will personally help you with the process of receiving and using a nail sizing kit, then keep you updated on the progress of your order. Glitzy ships all across the United States, and for the fairies who decide to place a Glitzy order, use code FAY2024 to receive a free cuticle oil pen and an in-depth guide on how to care for your nails. Follow at Glitzy Nails on Instagram to know about new updates and set releases and I would be so grateful for your support for the nail business I started my freshman year of college. But anyways, let's get back to the video. And we're back on campus too. This is also another really big canteen that students always go to. Wait, Hi, what did you text? I don't know, what did, what did I text you? <laughs> Dang, are you out of breath, girl? <laughs> and they want to go to South Korea in, uh, during winter with the kids. Oh, uh, South Korea. But, uh, I don't think my parents were saying yes. <laughs> Dying. Actually, my camera is also dying. <laughs> Everything is dying. <laughs> what am I doing? With your love. Skip, skip. I want the Care Bear Gracias. thingy. Gracias. Look, they have something with the Care Bear sticker. Oh, cute. Communism and communism. Yes. So cute, Care Bear. So cute, Care Bear. Care Bear. He's so self-absorbed. <laughs> What a child. What a child. And like George said, he's unbelievable. George said he's... <laughs> uh. And now it's time for my second class. How to use English to... Waterfall. Waterfall. Ah, you want Yeah. This class is my language and cross-cultural communications class, but today we had a presentation. Chinese country of Chinese uh, portraitism. So the cruelty of war, we can understand the sacrifice of our ancestors and cherish peace. Day in the life. Dumplings are gone. Dumplings. Bruh, 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 why are you jogging today then? Need oh. the practice to get a <laughs> good score. <laughs> now, go, let's see your form. Let's see, is this is your jogging form. It's gonna be six minutes, seven. No, oh, it's like five minutes. Five minutes is very slow. Like, she, I, I'll go to watch you and it'll just be you blurred out. <laughs> and I'll be like, look, there's Clarissa. Oh, I have three. Oh, heck yeah. Another one just arrived. <laughs> nice. Ifu. It's all Ifu. Oh, new clothes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 193,4,1,0,9,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,1,0,
bruh. Freaking ass. That is so bruh. That is a big ass rat. Yo, what's up? How's it going? Huh? This is Yarek, the coolest 14 um, year old on campus. <laughs> Show us your moves, Yarek. Oh, get it. Oh, get it. She needs a reason for her skipping. Yeah. Even though she just slept through classes. Yeah. <laughs> what? Why? Oh, yes. what is? Camera. Wow. What I'm do you want to hold her? Uh, can I? Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. You can zoom in like this. No, no. no. How? How can I? Uh -huh. Oh no, it's already recording. It's it's video. Ah, it's a video. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, hello, everyone. <laughs> You, wow! <laughs> oh my god! You want, now you want to get a camera? Yeah, yeah. I feel like even you more. Why are we here, Evro? Because Alicia uh, skipped didn't, all the morning didn't go classes. Go to all her morning classes. <laughs> <laughs> it's the male doctor. She understands yeah, English. I mean, I'm going to show up, and they're only going to speak Chinese, and I'll only understand 30% of it, and 30% of it is not enough for me to understand what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> I understand only what's up. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Are you coming to eat with us? Shut up. Oh, you shut up. <laughs> uh, I will spin you right, right, baby, right. <laughs> Okay, we just got to the barbecue place and the bathrooms here terrify me. Look at this. Bruh. Bruh. Look at this door. Bruh. Bruh. It doesn't even it doesn't even lock. Bruh. What is this? Bruh. Why? Hello? This is a cat cage. Is it? Mm -hmm. Is it really? Uh, I, I don't remember. Are you going to eat me? <gasps> I love this stuff. Put it back down. <laughs> oh, there you are. Cheers. Hello. <laughs> oh, she can see. <laughs> I think she gave up. <laughs> Good job, Avril. 10 out of 10. Yeah, I think you won. Yes. And now we're back. It's a dirty mirror. It's not doing anything. It's whatever. So yeah, I had a fantastic night. I said goodbye to the others, and then I went and I studied with a friend. I'm just gonna take off my makeup, go to bed, have wonderful dreams, and wake up for my 9.30 class tomorrow. So, see you in another video. Bye! Hey fairies, if you're still watching to this point, thank you. You're amazing. This video has taken a little bit over 30 hours to edit thus far. But I'm adding this little speech at the end, which I've written down, which is why I'll be looking down. <laughs> because there's a few people whom I want to hear this. And also, so that I can have a sense of closure. As my semester at UIC has most certainly concluded. To my classmates at UIC, thank you so much for always being so considerate and so kind to me. And for spending time with me even when my putonghua was not very good. <laughs> to my closest friends at UIC, you guys made my time at UIC truly wonderful and truly unforgettable. All the malls, beaches, and cities that we visited together, they have all become very treasured memories that I hold. Wonderful places that I'll never forget about. And I think most... And I think most of all, I am so grateful for, for the way that you guys loved me and cared for me and invited me, even knowing that I would have to leave after only a single semester at UIC. And to my one friend in particular, you know who you are. Well, I need Yongyuan.
friend, I'm so grateful to God to have known you. I learned so much through knowing you and will always remember all of the memories that we made together. I'm really happy that you've stayed in my life, even distantly. I can't wait to see many of you guys again when I go back to East Asia in the future. And, and I hope that the time that, that I was present in your lives left happy memories. The fall of 2023 was life-changing for me and it could have only been that way because of you guys. And I'm just so eternally grateful for you guys. And so, conclusion of this video. 祝你们健康长寿。再见。